These are the Shox wireless bone conduction headphones, and these type of headphones are making the waves in the market, and they could change the way personal audio is listened to. So get ready to free your ears and adapt your audio experience with these Shox headphones. These aren't your average headphones. They're potentially a game changer for runners, cyclists, and multitaskers alike. I took part in my first half marathon last week and used these for the entire two and a half hours of that race. Mainly organised races, particularly in the UK, encourage use of these type of headphones. And in fact, bone conducting headphones and the ones that don't sit in your ears are the only type of headphones that are approved for use in all road races in the UK, primarily for safety reasons. The open ear design of these allows runners and cyclists to maintain awareness of their surroundings, including traffic, emergency vehicles and other warning noises. I'm sure if you're a runner or a cyclist and you know how having situational awareness is so important for your own and potentially others safety being able to hear important ambient sounds which again is crucial when running or cycling on a road or late at night these are the shocks open move wireless bone conducting headphones and the reason why i bought them is because i used to run with my airpods pro but recently they've been prone to just falling out of my ear so i wanted a pair of headphones that i could guarantee well, are you going to stay on more securely? And another reason, which is very important to some certain runners, is security. Obviously, with in ear headphones or over the ear headphones, you essentially close yourself off to the outside world. But with these, they sit there on the ear, they sit there and allow you to listen to your music or podcasts while still being able to listen to your surroundings. I also wanted to find a pair of headphones that were an affordable alternative to the ever popular Shox open run headphones and other high-end brands. So I stumbled upon these Shox open roof headphones. So in the box you get the open move headphones which come in alpine white, elevation blue, Himalayan pink and these ones in slate grey. So you also get a USB-C charging cable a Shox branded carrying bag, and of course the user guide and instructions. Bone conduction technology is actually quite fascinating and I didn't really know what to expect when I first put these on. Unlike traditional headphones that transmit sound through the air into your ear canals, bone conduction headphones like these use vibrations. These vibrations go through your cheekbones directly into your inner ear, bypassing the eardrum entirely. This technology is not only innovative, but allows you to remain fully aware of your surroundings, making it a safer option for outdoor activities like cycling and running. It's the first time I've used bone conducting headphones before, and so I didn't really know what I was ex expecting when I first put them on. But strangely, really comfortable to wear, and the fit is totally unexpected. I mean, it sits comfortably, it doesn't shake around at all. If you're thinking of getting these and you're thinking that you're going to be getting superior sound quality compared to in ear or over the ear headphones that you're not, as you are trading in superior sound quality for safety and for some people comfort. These open move headphones do boast a range of features that do make them stand out. Their affordable price, which at $79.95 here in the UK, is priced competitively, ensuring that they offer a cost-effective solution to those high-end alternatives without compromising on the quality that you do get from spending more. You do get improved sound quality that, despite their modest price, the Open Move delivers sound quality that rivals the premium shops Open Run headphones. These certainly provide a good alternative that delivers clear and consistent dynamic stereo sound to you via that bone conduction technology. There are two sound modes available on these when listening to audio. There's a standard mode, generally for outdoor use, and a vocal booster mode, which is designed to make speaking audio when taking calls and listening to podcasts and audiobooks a lot clearer. Awareness of environment. One of the main attractions of bone conduction headphones, as well as other type of headphones that don't go in or on your ear, you can enjoy your music and podcast while still hearing traffic and other important sounds, which is crucial for safety during outdoor activity. Comfort. These are designed with comfort in mind, and weighing about 29 grams, they are less intrusive and more hygienic compared to in-ear headphones, and can be worn for extended periods without discomfort. It was definitely a learning curve deciphering how to get these on when I opened the box for the first time, and figuring out exactly where they need to sit. But now it's just a simple hook them over my ears, and then they just simply just rest naturally without ever actually feeling like they're going to come off. With both of these tethered together and giving you that sort of clamping feeling, it's definitely a look and feel that needs to get a bit of getting used to, particularly if you're coming from something like AirPods. Durability. 
They have an IP55 rating, which ensures they are sweat proof against splashing water, making them robust companions for your workout. Battery life. With up to six hours of battery life and standby of up to 10 days, they can support you through long runs and cycling sessions. Although when you have depleted the battery, charging them via the USB-C cable inserted in here will take up to two hours. Bluetooth 5.1 multi-port connectivity, which allows you to connect multiple devices, both Apple and Android, and gives you a wireless range of 33 feet. When it comes to physical activities, these for me are a game changer. Their secure fit ensures they stay in place during vigorous movements, which for me is running. And their open air design keeps you connected to your environment, which is essential for safety during outdoor sports. Whether you're sprinting down a track or cycling through busy streets, these headphones won't let you down. They are easy to operate when on the move thanks to the simplicity in its design. Buttons on this are quite simple. All you've got is your volume up and volume down on this side. And you can also change the um, sound enhancement for whether you're listening to music or whether you're listening to podcasts or audiobooks or things like that. When nothing is playing, either button will tell you the current battery level. Long pressing the plus button turns the headphones on and off. And then on the other side, you've got your general play button. One tap to play pause, two taps to skip to the next track, and three taps to go back to the previous track. See? Simple. My only downside to these, and it's not an issue for me with short hair, but for someone with longer or thicker hair, that's that headband that goes around the back of your head, which may be awkwardly moved repeatedly by longer hair that either sits on top or underneath the headband. But for my use, this isn't an issue. But take note if you think it might be an issue for you, as most bone conduction headphones are designed in this way. Despite this, these Shox Open Move Bone Conduction headphones are an excellent choice for anyone looking for quality, affordability and safety in their audio experience. They are particularly well suited for athletes and outdoor enthusiasts who need to stay aware of their surroundings. And with the Open Move headphones, you can enjoy the benefits of advanced technology without breaking the bank. If you fancy getting a pair of these for yourself, I'll leave the link in the description below. Remember, the important thing is to always stay safe and enjoy your music responsibly. If you enjoyed this video, press the like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos just like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.